We have new information about a pipe bomb found at Pier Park and Gross Point Farms. The discovery was made yesterday afternoon, closing down the park. Everything reopened this morning. Jacqueline Francis is there live with what we're learning and how the community is reacting. Well, here's what we know. Yesterday around noon, a park employee found the explosive device near the entrance. Not knowing what it was, they picked it up and they tossed it into the lake. It was later spotted and deemed a suspicious object. We now know it was a pipe bomb. It did not go off. It was neutralized, but the questions, well, they're just starting. Nice neighborhood, nice town. Um, I don't know why it would happen here. It's hard to make sense of. Why would someone bring an explosive device to the park? But now it's just another thing to kind of look out for that there could be pipe bombs at the park. Gross Point Farms families reacting to the news after learning a pipe bomb was found at their beloved park Friday. Police say an employee tossed the pipe bomb into the water, the device measuring at five to six inches long. Once in the lake, the bomb squad and other agencies were called in to help. The area was secured and the bomb was neutralized. I'm not really shocked because of just how society has gone with school shootings and, um, you know, all the craziness that's on TikTok and social media about, you know, doing different things and just trying to shock um, shock people and it's but it's really sad I who would think at the park like what's what's controversial about the park or like why you know why here where it's mostly kids and families 24 hours later and it's like nothing ever happened the park reopened Saturday morning after no other suspicious objects were found it doesn't seem like anything happened today it just seems like a normal day in the park it's you know a beautiful day that we're enjoying with our family and friends and this is the first we're hearing of it which is also surprising you think there would be more talk about it there are still a lot of questions out there, like who would put a pipe bomb in the park and why police say the investigation is ongoing. Reporting live in Gross Point Farms, Jacqueline Francis, Local 4. All right, Jacqueline, thank you.